Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a step-by-step -step brow routine. So if you are interested in seeing how I do my brows, then please keep on watching. Okay, so as you can see, I have done one of my eyebrows. I just thought you don't really need to see me do two because I do the exact same on each side. So I just thought I would do one of my eyebrows and do this eyebrow. So let's jump straight into it. My favorite brow product that I like to use is the Inglot AMC Brow Gel Liner in the shade 16. It's just like a a pomade similar to like Anastasia Beverly Hills and all that sort of stuff. Um, it's a really nice like, it's just a nice brown colour. <laughs> like it just goes well on everyone, like even blondes. It looks really nice on because you can darken it up and you can also kind of make it look a little bit more natural as well. And the brush that I'll be using is my Holy Grail Brow Definer brush. This brush is just a really nice angled small angled brush to use for your brows. I like to use this brush just because it does let me, because um, it's so small and defined, it does give you that extra definition on your brows and it does let you make them a little bit neater. I also forgot to mention that I use like a little spoolie thing. Um, you can get them from like eBay for like, I don't even know, for like a pack of like 50 for like 50 cents, something like that, I don't know. But they're just really handy to have to just brush out your brows, obviously some some um, some brow brushes have them on the other end. So probably should zoom in, shouldn't I? Start off by just defining underneath the brow first. So pretty much you're just drawing a line underneath your brow, like so. And then I like to draw a bit of a line at the top and just define my arch a little bit more. That was a bit rude. To just bring up that part just a tiny bit. Mm -hmm. The good thing about doing your brows first is that you, if you mess up, you can just wax it off. I start um, filling in the center of the brow then once I get to the front I like to draw a line not all the way but closer to the front then getting a little bit more product I kind of just like to brush up with a really light hand because I don't like the front of my brow to look too dark just really light and then I like to just get my spoolie and I always just brush through as well which I help I find helps like blend out like any like crazy harsh lines and that sort of thing then for the tail of my brow so I just draw like the outer lines on each side of my brow and then down into a point. I like to expect I like to extend my brow slightly, but not too much because my brows do go down quite far anyway. And then just fill in the middle. Just with light little strokes. I do like the tail of my brow to be darker than the front of my brow, so I do put a lot more product at the end. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, if you do um, accidentally get anything underneath your brows, it doesn't matter because we're going to clean it up with some concealer after. So. Um. I 
filming them, but I was gonna say now. So once I have finished filling in my brow, I am just gonna go in with some concealer underneath. The concealer that I like to use is the MAC Select Cover Up in the shade MC20. So I really like this concealer because it's not anything too heavy. It just it just covers up what it needs to cover up and gives a good base for the eyeshadow. So to carve out underneath my brow, I'm going to be using my Holy Grail Angle Definer. So it's just a little bit bigger than, than the brow definer brush that I was using before. So I'm just taking a little bit of product on that and I'm just going to draw a line underneath my brow. And then I just pull the product down away from the brow. Like so. Ends up any mistakes you've made. So to put the rest of the concealer on my eyelids, I'm going to take the Holy Grail Concealer Buffer Brush and I'm just going to pop this over the rest of my lid. And just buff this in. Just to further blend this out, I'm going to take my beauty blender and just buff over the top. Okay, and before that, before that concealer creases, I'm just going to take my Holy Grail Fluffy Blender brush and my Australis Fresh and Flawless Powder. This is in the shade deep natural and I'm just gonna blend it all over the lid. So when you're completing this step just make sure that you've set everywhere on your eyelid otherwise when you're going to do your eyeshadow there's gonna be some tacky bits and your eyeshadow won't blend nicely over the top of the concealer and that is not what you want. So pretty much just pop this all over your lid, pack it on. So that is the completed step-by-step -step brow tutorial. So I just realized that my camera died and stopped recording my outro. So I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. I did record the rest of my makeup in another video that will be up on Thursday. So keep your eyes open for that. I hope you all have a good day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.